What's up everybody, welcome to the Tommy Show. Uh, we've joined with Alex again. So today, uh, we've got a few topics. Uh, first one is, it's mainly to do with you. To do with me? Yeah, it's to do like with your, with your past, right? So, like, when you were younger... Good video, guys, from the there. <laughs> yeah. When you were younger, you were, I'm going to say fat, yeah? Massive. <laughs> Like when you when you're yeah, in high school, high school. What, what year did you sort of did it sort of change? Because you used to play football and uh, be ha- active, didn't you? Year eight. Year eight. So yeah. from year eight onwards, it <laughs> yeah. went downhill. So like, did it, when yeah. you were when you were in the process of getting gaining weight. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, did you see it or did you did you like think about it or? Nah. Or is it just mm. some other... I saw it, but didn't want to see it. Like, if it were, if clothes were getting tighter, yeah, you just... I'd just buy bigger clothes yeah. and not address the issue. Yeah. And I never, ever looked in the mirror. No. Never, ever. <laughs> Opposite of you. Yeah. But no, you don't. No, you just, you see, you've, um... oh man, it was bad. You, you see it, but you don't see it. And when people used to record me or take pictures of me, I'd look and go, fucking hell. That's me in my head, mm. but obviously, because at the time you don't see it unless you look at yourself. Because I never used to look at myself, never looked in the mirror, and you yeah you just you'd hide the fact by just buying bigger shit or just yeah and you obviously don't see it and don't look at it and just if you know what I mean if it's outside out of mind sort of thing mm. at the time yeah. and it creeps on as well it does creep up. Oh, like yeah. it don't yeah. come out you don't get yeah. you don't get fat overnight it takes it creeps up on you and by the time you you want to address it you've already got there you're like fucking hell I've let myself go this far before mm. taking charge of it but it, 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 it like I said it, it happens as a steady process yeah. like losing weight it's, it doesn't happen overnight does it like yeah. gaining weight doesn't happen overnight either so like when was the when was when did you realise that sort of that I had an issue I've got to change it yeah I've got to change uh wow! After just just after we left high school, yeah. Immediately after we left high school, when we left in like May twenty thirteen, it must have been. It was probably, it was probably June. It was literally like we left on like twenty fourth of May, didn't we? Mm. And then it was like the beginning of June. I looked in the mirror, and it was like, yo, this is this is bad, and I've I've still got the photo somewhere, what I took. And I was like, fucking, this is not good. Because it was the first time I'd actually looked in the mirror without my top on yeah. in, like, uh, two or three years, yeah. seriously. And it was like, whoa, this is bad now. I'm sat here every day eating shit, drinking shit, feeling like shit, and I'm, I'm, this isn't me. Uh, this is not me. This is not who I am. I'm not this fat guy. This is someone. This is not me. This is someone else. This. And it was like, I, if I don't, if it doesn't, if I don't, change now or don't do something now then I'm going to end up like 30 stone like with these guys you see you know what I mean they were yeah. bed bound so I'd, I'd start you know what I mean yeah. so like what what were the first actions of changing uh, diet like what what you went from kebabs takeaways yeah. to energy drinks to water nothing but water and tea and coffee yeah to chicken breasts with green beans, to little sandwiches on brown bread with one tin of tuna and cucumber, and I'd make two sandwiches out of one tin of mm. tuna. Um, I'd mayo. have loads of fruit, loads of fruit. Yeah, I'd have mayo. Yeah. I'd have loads of fruit. I I started eating natural yogurt, and I also I started walking everywhere, didn't I? Because mm. after we left high school, yeah. I started walking everywhere, yeah. up and down, and just, oh, fucking out. I used to starve myself, me. Seriously, I used to go. I used to go to bed starving. It's horrible, isn't it? When you and I used to, like, I used to intentionally eat. get up later in the day, so I'd have so less time have to less, eat in the less day. Less meals. Yeah. Less less time to eat. I used yeah. to have fifteen hundred calories every day, no more. It was the calorie count. Every single thing I had, I was going mentally insane. Yeah. I was going insane. It was bad, and I did it's get bad. anorexic at one point. I went from one, one <coughs> place on the scale to the other, to, uh, one drastic yeah. measure to the other. Hmm. And it were it were bad man, proper really bad, and it, you didn't it, you don't see the thing is you don't see when you're fat as well, but the anorexia you didn't see when you was really skinny either. Mm. Like I got really skinny, like nearly collapsing out of baths and shit. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, like, 
but my dad and my sister and that were like, and even Sam's mum at one point were like, are you alright? Like, you look really ill. Are you alright? You, you look really poorly. Yeah. You look really, there's no colour to you and you look all drawn out. So you like got to a point where you were like thin and then just carried on. So yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got up to like 137 pound. At like six foot when I was like proper drawn out and white. Gangly. And everyone were like, you look ill, mate. Yeah. You know, you're trying to lose weight intentionally or what you're doing, you need to go to the doctor to see if you keep losing. Because I used to say, because I knew, I didn't know I was skinny, but I knew I was trying to lose weight and I was trying to lose weight on purpose. And people were like, you're trying to lose weight? And I'm like, no, 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 I don't know, I don't know why. I'm, I'm What's being, happening to me? I've been like 1,200 calories a day at this point and they'd be like, why, why are you getting skinnier then if you're not trying to lose weight? It's bad that. Oh, I don't know. I'd go to doctors and if I were you, because that's not good that. And I knew I'd be in full well while yeah, I'm getting yeah. skinnier, yeah. but I won't admit it to anyone. Mm. And it was bad, man. Anorexia is fucking bad. I did have anorexia, man. Didn't it? That is, I, you know what I mean. I'm one of the people where you do like I sort of do laugh at people's mental illnesses and that, but I won't anymore with, especially with that shit, because that is a mental illness. You can't. You could. I could have physically looked in the mirror, a full length mirror, and I could not see what you what you could have seen or whatever. It did not register in my brain mm. of how skinny I got and how poorly I looked, and I just wanted to keep going. Me. Yeah. I can't even remember I just it just clicked in my head one day like yeah this is fucking good this this is not good you know my body's starving all the time I have no energy I'm cold all the time so I'm freezing all the time that's another thing I want we're freezing all the time no and I used to my hands got really burning didn't they and yeah. I used to get in I used to get in and end of day and I could have like you could uh, it got to the point where my hands got that skinny and that you could boil a kettle put it in the in the sink and I could dip my hands in and go like ah just keep it there in boiling water yeah yeah just warm the oh. bones up because that's because a man's that cold and I was that that skinny and it got you cold all the time yeah cold all the time yeah so and then yeah so I'm all, I've got back up there now but uh, I'm going to be like I wear like 13 stone at a minute yeah going back up it yeah so I need to lose another couple of stone or a stone and I have to get back yeah. to where I want to be and just yeah. maintain it but so yeah, that's how I got there, and then I went from one right. one extreme to other. But I can remember when I started to lose the weight when I first left high school. I pirated Tony Orton's P90X, mm. and I started doing that at my dad's house, and I just used to do that every day for like five days a week, every day, and then I'd be on like fifteen hundred calories a day, and then it just shot off. I walk in five mile a day, yeah. nothing but water, yeah. and it just come off, it just flew yeah. off. It's easy. Yeah. Flew off, didn't it? I started clock and I thought I was skinny in college. But you said I wasn't, didn't you? Really? You said I was still chubby in college, but I thought mm. I was already skinny in college. Mm. But then that was it. I got really skinny and then we used to walk up first in London, that didn't we? Because mm. after I left college as well, I did. I had no what to do for a yeah. year. So yeah, I used to no. walk everywhere. Yeah. Walk Bruce. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 But, now it's just working and that neat. Would you say you eat how many calories would you say? Not a lot. What minute? Not like not two thousand? No. Nah, I'm probably on about eighteen hundred at the minute. Mm. Yeah. Just trying to lose weight like today. <sighs> Fucking hell today I rushed out. I was supposed to leave at twenty past seven. I got out of bed at twenty past seven today. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I rolled out. I, my alarm went off at twenty to seven. Yeah. And I thought, oh, five more minutes, I'll turn it off. Oh, five more minutes, rolled up. <laughs> 20 past seven. Got him like, yo, you need to go, it's 20 past seven. Oh, fuck, fuck it. Fuck it, she's just no started waiting. Bit. If she hadn't said that, I had got up, I would have been late for work. She said, you need to go, it's 20 past seven. Oh, fuck it. So I rolled out of bed, got dressed, rushed to work, no coffee, nothing. Like proper tea. rush, got everything proper on. Proper rush, not yeah. even had a drink. Yeah. Got dressed. Did that with me hair once and then walked out the door. <laughs> up, no warming car up, straight off. <laughs> nearly killed, nearly killed like 10 people on the way to work. <laughs> so I got there and then I had a cup of coffee, what I do in the morning. And then I fucking thought, oh, I've no food. And I had a pot noodle in my car, what I'd left in my car from like the week earlier, what I couldn't be asked having. Yeah. So I had a pot noodle for lunch. That's 550 calories, says it on it. And then I got home and I had a scotch egg and a croissant. And that's like another probably 400 calories. Mm. Um, 450 calories. So that's about 1,000 calories. And then I had that pasta bolognese. Mm. 
So yeah. I don't even know what's in that. I might even ask, but that's what I've had. I've had a pot noodle, scotch egg, a croissant, and then my tea. Yeah. And that's all I'm going to have today. Uh, I can't remember what I had yesterday. Mm. I, had a, I think I had a ham salad sandwich homemade for lunch yesterday. And then I had, what did I have for dinner yesterday? I had Azimis. But I only ate twice yesterday. Mm. So I I'm not I eating could. massive amounts of food at the minute. Yeah. But I'm not exercising either. Which pisses so me don't off. Go yeah, stays. well, it's coming off, but it's very slowly. Yeah. Like if I am walking five miles a day, it'd be coming off like that. But, mm. fucking hell, just, it's dark, innit? When I get home, I get home at quarter to five. I eat, I eat, and then uh, it's, well, I don't eat till she gets home at minute. She doesn't get home till like 20 past six. <laughs> so, and then it's, it's dark, and then she don't want to go out, and I don't want to go out either, to be honest. When it's dark, you can't be asked, it's freezing. You get a head touch. If you There's want nowhere to, to walk there around Melfort either, where there I is. am, immediately where I live. Up that lane, up your road, right, all the way to the top of there. There's a massive walkway, but it's, it's in the fields, isn't it? Yeah, I've been, up to, I've been up that one, up Tinker Lane, I think it is. Mm. But I haven't walked all the way up. I've walked up to the gate, like the farmer's gate, and then I've come back down. No, no, you go across, like, across to my granddad's, or across the other way, there's a massive walkway. You have to show me. That way, yeah. You have to come over and show me. We'll mm. do it. It light. Of course. Yeah. But uh, I wish I could, uh, like, um, like, I remember, like, at college and whatnot, I used to eat. I didn't go to the gym when I was at college. And I used to eat, well, like, whatever I want to. I used to, like, eat, um, I used to go to the pound shop every day and buy, like, two packets of sweets. Yeah. Those that's big shit packets. Yeah. Like, yeah. I used to buy that and I just used to eat. Like, what we what would you call normal food and sort of yeah. normal diet. Like, now I can't really. It's like you see, like, a pot, like a yogurt pot, and you think, ooh, shall I have it, shall I not? Nah, I'll just have a banana. Yeah, it's full of sugar, like them yogurt pots. Yeah. Like yeah. what you buy in, like, the supermarket mm. and that pound shop. Full of sugar, man. Yeah, they're bad, but just having, having it, being on a diet is shit, isn't it? Yeah, it is it shit. It gets boring if you have it the same old shit and you've just got... Yeah, it is shit. It's the lack of variety, I find shit, mm. in a diet. It's like you have... I had sea bass for, like, two two months. Yeah. I just don't have any more. I'm sick of it. It's horrible. Yeah, exactly. I can't stand the I smell mean, of it. There's no variety in your diet. And then... Well, it can be, but it's effort and it's got some money yeah. variety in your diet. And then you don't look forward to eating anymore. No. You don't enjoy the food. It is literally like becomes if you become one of those people where it's just fuel. Mm. Whereas I'm not. I like to enjoy certain parts of food. It's one of the little things in life you can enjoy, isn't it? Mm. So I want to enjoy some of it. I don't want that to be completely nullified as well. Mm. Like if you, you know what I mean. But if I, if it's what it's whatever you want to do, if I want to lose weight, then yeah, I'll, I'm going to start eating the same the same sort of food on a daily basis till I've lost it's some routine, weight. Routine, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, your routine as well. And it's only a diet because after I've got to the weight I want to get to, I'll start introducing the, f- the other foods what I used to eat. Yeah. yeah. Just you know more moderation and exercise more to maintain. Yeah. You know what I mean? You can't stand a diet forever. Well, some people do, but fucking miserable, aren't they? Well, that's like uh, what's it, Sunny? Um, unless it's Arnold's. Yeah, unless you're a bodybuilder yeah. or something. Like fucking hell! I mean, if you're like a yeah. school teacher who talks about it every lunchtime. I'm having kale for dinner. <sighs> Have you tried this diet? Oh my Tins of tuna. Weight of points have you got? Yeah, I don't like weight watchers. Shit. No, it don't, don't work, man. Points. Diets don't work. It's a, it's a lifestyle, isn't it? Yeah. It's yeah. a lifestyle. Yeah. It's not, I won't even call it what we do it, like what I'm doing. I weigh like 30, just over 13 stone now. For me to get to 11 and a half, it's not, I'm not even dating, I'm just. Like going back to my normal lifestyle, mm. like it's just like a like a, a reboot in it in your system because once I've got there, I'm not gonna balloon back up again to thirteen, fourteen start, and I'm gonna you know what I mean. I was le- you know what I mean. I've not been I've not been massive. I've not been overly massive since I lost all the weight, like bloody like three year ago now nearly. So obviously you know what I mean. It's not a diet because yeah. you'd be up and down, wouldn't you? You know, what I, mean? I don't get people who can lose, lose loads of weight and then can't maintain it. Maintaining it's so much easier, in my opinion, than losing it. 
you know what I mean? You don't have to stress out as much as yeah. you can think, oh, I can have this dessert and it won't hurt, this one time won't hurt. Yeah. That's maintaining. Whereas losing, you know, you can't have any of it. As lo- like, if you if you get to the point where you maintain it, you can have, like, whatever you want, sort of thing, as long as you burn it all off. Well, yeah, exactly. And if you exercise in all time, you can eat whatever you want anyway. Yeah. Like, I've you know sort what I mean? of... Like, go, like, I can't have... Well, I can have normal meals, but, like... I've just, it's just weird, I just, like, thinking about it, it's just, it's just weird, like, me, I don't know, it's just, eating normal food. What's normal food, though? Like, what do you mean? To me, normal food's like, you know, like, what everyone else has, like, you've got, like, Sure, I should have, like, a bacon, egg, butter for breakfast, or a full English for breakfast, and then, mm. or if you go out, we'll have a burger and chips, or... Like, free, like, also freezer food, like, like, people buy... No, I'm not big on freezer no, food. No, free, you know, like, those cod things, there's... yeah. Like fish cakes, you get them. Them sort, like that's what I used to eat a lot. What about waffles, like, I, I you like waffles, waffles yeah, proper waffles, yeah. But it's just, it's just weird thinking that I'd be sat down and I wouldn't be eating like chicken or rice or. Yeah, but that's just the nice thing. I know, yeah. and it's just, it's just weird that you could eat. Well, it's whatever you want to do. It's whatever you want to do, and whatever your willpower is. Like I want, like I'm bored of like um, losing weight. <laughs> Like I've got, I've got like last like three months. Like How much do you wear? Now? Three months ago, I weighed eighty-four kilograms. Three months ago, you weighed eighty-four. Yeah. And yeah. I wear seventy-four. Now you wear seventy-four. Yeah. And it's sort of like to point like I'm I'm lean. Yeah. I've just like, I've lost a lot of fat. I'm yeah. just all fat. Yeah. Like I wanna, I wanna go back on a, a like another diet that's a lean bulk but yeah. involves some flavor like some sort of sweet <sighs> stuff. That's the thing is, I'm. I fuck. I, I admit, I do fuck about me when it comes to like a, what I want to do with my body because mm. it's easy to just lose weight and just get lean, mm. and I can do that because it's easy to me. Minimal exercise, just walking about, keeping active, going for playing football, yeah. and having a a healthy diet. You'll lose the weight. You'll lean out. But I want to lean bulk as well. But it's it's a lot of it's. Uh, it's not even the food because I know what food to eat and how much to eat. It's just the gym every day. You, you get to a point where five days a week. You get to a point though when you. It's the thing you know when you don't want to go out drinking because it's it's not drinking. It's the going out part. Do you know when you said it's not drinking? It's just going out. That's yeah, what you oh, said. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <coughs> That's like me with the gym. It's not the gym. It's the going to the gym. Yeah. If you know what I mean, like yeah. once I'm there, I'm there. I'm all right. If you went out drinking, once you're there, you'd be all right. Mm. It's, it's like going there. It's going out drinking for you. It's going to the gym for me. You know what I mean? And <laughs> I don't stupid. even know That's why. Sense. Like you don't know why it's. I, I don't just, know. I don't it's know. just like I, it's all you the... know what's coming, and it's like you know because you don't have to go. Yeah. You fuck it off. Yeah. And I do. I, I do. Fucking hell. You know what I mean? I've, but a lot of it was. I, that I didn't. Mm, I like the gym, but the time when I went, I didn't like it busy. And it was a lot of money anyway. Thirty six pound in my current situation. There's one in town that costs twelve pound a month, fifteen pound a month. That's twenty four seven. See, that's the type of gym I want to go to. But then it was like twenty four hour gym. When would I go? With my work. Do you like whenever, I mean? like at night or in the yeah. day, or I wake up, go to bed early, get up early. Like at a minute, like I do my, I do my um, free shift start. Mm-hmm. So I do, I'm doing my eight, well four shift at a minute. And if I'm doing that, I'd have to like go. If I if I'm going to gym on an eight four, I go to gym later that night. Did you? Or, yeah. yeah. And then if I'm doing like a, if I'm doing my nine fives and ten sixes, I'd probably go in the morning before work. Mm. There's a showers at that gym. Yeah, it will be. Yeah, so I'd rather go before work and then like late, so there's no one in. Cause it's just that like stigma, man, and you know, even though no, I know as well, nobody looks at you. It's not that. It's like I, th- I yeah. think they are, even though I know they're not. It's stupid, isn't it? But a lot of people are like that. Mm. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's bullshit, but that's, and it's the consistency in it. If you want to get results, it's well, five days a week, bit. isn't it? Yeah. Well, it's free. Well, it's whatever. It's, it's three dieting times a week. is the hard bit, isn't it? In, real, in, in realistic terms. Yeah, it is. Yeah, because exercise is exercise, isn't it? Yeah. You know, you know, there's a plan to what you're doing. Yeah. 
You've just got to... And you know how much you exercise. You can't over-exercise. Yeah. You know? And it, but it is the food, isn't it? Mm. I mean, it's just the prepping it all as if well. If you buy it all... If you buy it bulk, or you go out and you know it, and ten... You've got, like, like, if you have a shopping list, it's easier, a lot easier. Yeah. Because you know what you need and what you buy. Otherwise, you're just looking around, or oh, can I have that? Yeah, that's can what I, have I that. do. Yeah. That's what I'm going to start doing when I move back in. Mm. I want to make a list of just get the basics, man. Get the veg, just prep the fruit, it. and the lean proteins. Just prep it on a, like a Sunday or whatever on a night. Yeah. Cook, cook all your. Like, I want to do it, man. Cause I want to lose the weight and then I want to build some muscle, man. And I keep saying it. We've had this conversation, haven't we? We have, haven't we? <laughs> but fucking hell, we're not, I never get anywhere, do I? Well, is it? Yeah, and it's not that. It's like. I'm just going in, I go around in circles, me with my body, like, oh, what else in life? <laughs> Whether it's saving for something or doing something for someone yeah. or helping someone or working towards, a, you know, a money goal or something else, I can do it. But when it comes to my body, I just fucking, I don't know, I, I just don't stick to it. Mm. Like, like you said with um, Harry, I had the conversation of, like, uh, making videos, like, like taking him to the gym yeah. and sort of filming him in the gym like his start see that'd be like a big I'd be sweating over that me trying to record myself in gym <laughs> no no you'd have someone else else before you mean. think somebody's looking at you oh fuck me I'm still like that I'm like that I'm like that putting the phone <laughs> yeah that's what I mean though yeah yeah and especially if you're not big as well <laughs> look it's some scrawny yeah exactly three kilograms I know it shouldn't matter but Bump. <laughs> it don't matter but no People think it matters. Some people think it matters. Like if I, I like recording yourself's fine. But like having a, someone recording you is is a lot different in it. Like, yeah, it is. Like, what the fuck's that guy doing over there? What's he? It's, it's like a big ego statement. Yeah. Yeah. Like if, yeah, if some big guys walk around and he's getting filmed, and then you got <laughs> little guy. You know, it's big. But um, yeah. but like if you film like the start, take all your pictures. I've still got them pictures somewhere. Um, the pictures of me and you yeah, yeah exactly I ask, and I'm glad you've kept them because I want to yeah. look Got, back on them and then I want to get an after picture I'm working on the after picture <laughs> love some, process at some yeah. point yeah I've got them like you do the video and then you could like like a big you know when you see like 2011 yeah, to 2018 yeah. transformation like you could like a massive long video of it yeah yeah but um, nah I want to I do that I will think like, I wish I could do it. I wish I had a house where you could do it at home, man. You I have. Would... Everyone has. There's no... No, but like, I, could, I wish I had space to do bust out weights. Oh, but that, yeah, my that's... my dad's house. But I don't. No. Like, if, if you could afford it, you could buy weights and we could, I could put them at my granddad's and you could do it at my granddad's. Yeah, exactly. Because you got that big, you know, that big yeah. space. You could put it all there, but... Oh, I'd do that, mate. Yeah. I'd go after you. Cold. I'd go after you with a weight, big weight set and yeah. do it at your granddad's, yeah. and I'd come over every night, five days a week, and do it at your granddad's. Yeah. Because there'd be no fucking pressure, man. It's easy, anyone. I mean, no one around. And you can record. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? You would do. I'll, I'll go after you if you wanted. You have to yeah. find some weight sets where we do out max the weight <laughs> in like a week. Yeah. And then you're like, what we're we doing? Yeah. Like could... Yeah, if you've still got your punching bag and, that, and your yeah. mats. Yeah, that's I would need, you know what I mean, it's like a bench and whatever. You could even bench. get a squat rack as well in the space you've got at your granddad's. Squat rack, I don't want a squat rack. Bench and a squat rack and then just barbells and dumbbells. Yeah. I don't know what else you'd need. I don't think you'd need what else. You could run on the moors if you wanted to go running. If you wanted to, yeah. 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 Walk as well. I'd rather walk me if you're doing weights as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be a good idea. That definitely, I'll, I'll, I will definitely save some money for some weight for a big weight set and go after on you mm. if you want for next year and start doing it. Because like that, that's where that's the only way I'm going to get kicked off and started before I feel comfortable going to the gym or whatever. Like if you went, if right, right, say the beginning of the year next year, yeah, yeah. Like you eat a lot of shit now to up till the end of Christmas and yeah. we go on holiday and eat a lot of shit well, there. I'm, I'm fine fighting that as well at the minute. Yeah, yeah. Because otherwise I'll be forty and starve at the end of Christmas. Yeah. But yeah, go on. And then, and then like on my YouTube channel or, or like if you create your own YouTube channel, we'd yeah. like do a, like, I'd have my vlogging and then I'd have my series, different series like yeah. at the gym or whatever. Like, um, like basically we just film everything like we do. 
yeah. sort of thing. Like, you could have like you know like what Wings did with boot camp. Yeah, yeah. You could have it where you're filming me and like my transformation yeah, and yeah. whatever. And like, the thing is, like with like you, like if you have, it's like with Harry, he went to the gym for a week, two weeks. Yeah. He went, he ate healthy and whatever for two weeks, and then he gave up because. Yeah. It's the mindset into it. Once it is. once you get into the mindset, you sort of it's fine. Yeah. But like, um, like you know the you know when we used to go to the gym together. Yeah. And you used to be oh, I can't be asked. Oh, not today. Yeah. Like you've got to you've got to be on it. Like like you on you work. You sat down most of the day. You would be, yeah. you'd be able to eat during the day or whatever. But yeah. Uh, you need like. It's like wings. He won't. He wouldn't work out. On his own, he needed. Uh, yeah, he, but he's he don't want to lose. He's getting weight, a surgery. Sir. Yeah, I think so. Something like that. But um, yeah, it's like the twelve pa- fifteen pound a month one. It's fifty pound a month, no contract. So if you did that for like however many months until you've got enough for whatever, mm. and then my granddad's, then. Would you would you do that or not? I'd do that, yeah. But I'd rather do it at your end. Yeah, yeah, but that. you'd have to start somewhere. Like, if you start at the gym, say, in the morning, get up really early. Yeah. It'd be like, it'd, it'd be it'd be a lot easier, wouldn't it? In the in the morning, like if you got up at four. Fucking hell, four. But it's like. Yeah, but if you work, you start work at eight, and you got to set off. I've got, I'd have to set off at like ten past seven, twenty past seven. You can do that. Yeah, but you're getting up at four. And yeah, then you're working a full day. Yeah, but it's lots of people do it. They do. They do. They lots don't. of people work out in the morning. Go to the, yeah, go lots of people work. work out in the morning, then go to work. But their work isn't a shift work or like 8-4 their work is I get up early and then I go run my own business or I get up early no, I and then I start work at 10 well 6 or it's not fucking I get up at 4 me and then I start at 6 or 7 not a lot of people do do that but not a lot of people do that but if you do it hard. you get the the mindset of you know getting up mm. all that I'm not I don't have a problem getting up fucking hell I find it hard getting up sometimes, but I get up. Yeah. It's not, you know what I mean? Because it's that's that's, my, that's in my brain. I have to do it cause for work. Mm. If you went to bed at half, if you went to bed at ten, ten, yeah, for six hours sleep, you can, you yeah, can but there's work. The difference between going to bed at ten and going to sleep. Yeah, but ten. that's what you've got to go to sleep at ten, <laughs> and not go to bed <laughs> on your yeah. phone. Oh, well, I'm not getting up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, work. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> like you've got to have yeah you got to have it you got to, you, yeah but like I said I mean immediately I need to that's the thing I need to lose weight first before we do, can do, I do the lean bulk don't yeah. really because I can't lose weight and then I can't do one or the other really I've got to do one or the other I've got to lose weight first and lean bulk or bulk on top of this which mm. is what I don't want to do because yeah. I'm fucking out I've got, I bet I've got, I bet I've got 25, at least 25 pounds of fat, like, big visible fat, not the like, the fat you've got, you've got fat but not, it's mm. fucking minute, it's isn't it? Yeah. I've got like 25 pounds of proper fat, probably, what I can you cut straight off, mm. and then think about lean bulking. Yeah. Do you go to like, in, like, you can walk... I, I won't need to go that's what I'm saying I won't pay for the gym to lose the weight the initial weight before I start the lean bulk because I could do that on my own without the gym but that's the thing I could do that with just diet like if I'm doing that right now yeah well if yeah, the, the thing could, with the diet the thing with the gym is like like I used to say I'll do a workout at home but when you're at home you don't feel like you'll never you know I, I did me. I used to do the T25 videos at my dad's house. Yeah. I'd do them right now. But I feel... Before Courtney gets home, but I don't have them. They're at my dad's house. Mm. Like, they're ripped on his Mac. I don't, have, I don't have a PC at my house. Yeah. Like, you feel much better working out in a gym or environment that's, you know, gym-related mm. than at I home. just feel better when I work after I've worked. If I break a full sweat, you feel amazing after that. 
mm. no matter where you are, in my opinion. Yeah. Like, you know, me and Sam are on about start playing football again and going for a kickabout two or three times a week to drop the weight yeah, off. That to drop last summer. <laughs> you run about it over the weekend. For oh, him. Yeah. No for run today. No, Eight well, mile. Uh, knack. Twelve mile in an hour. <laughs> but you're on yeah. about Lewis starting playing football two or three times a week last week and, and I said, yeah, I'd be on that. You know what I mean? I used to drive everyone to the football pitches up at Sovereign to play football. I've still got my boots. Mm. So I'd be up for that me, my balls popped, that's why I don't, <laughs> don't that's yeah. why I ain't gone since. Yeah. But yeah, and that you, the, the way you'd come straight off that as well, you used to get a drench in sweat man after a kickabout. Yeah. So I did that on top of the, the, the food I'd start eating, start eating clean again. Yeah. I could I could get to I I could pro, I'd probably get I pro, I wanna get to a, uh, eleven and a half stone. So that's like hundred and sixty pound, hundred and sixty one pound, and then lean bulk mm. to one eight to gain twenty pounds of muscle or whatever to mm. one eight to, and then just maintain that. So I don't want to be really fucking skinny either. Being there, gonna get there again. It's horrible though, because you don't feel, you don't feel. Um, I don't know, you just don't feel like you could handle yourself if somebody tried to like pick a fight with you because yeah. you, you're skinny and you, yeah. you you don't, you know what I mean? You've nothing behind you. Do you feel like that now? No, I feel like <coughs> no, I feel all right now. Yeah. I feel good now, yeah, because I'm like 13 and a half stone. So, yeah, mm. I feel heavy handed, I feel heavy, heavy on the foot. It's good and bad, but I don't yeah. feel weak. Yeah. And you can tell, man, you can tell. As soon as I started eating properly again, when I went from like anorexic to like eating normal, eating normal portions and normal food, man, I gained, I gained, I gained like 20 pound and got to like 168. And I was like, fucking hell, yeah, it's, I can feel it. I'm a lot better now. I'm fuller in the face. Yeah. I've got colour back. You know, as I'm walking, there's heav- heavier in my steps. You know, I feel, I don't feel like I can just be, Blown bro, bro, bro over, do you know what I mean? And it, it, you do feel better. Yeah. But now I feel a, a bit too much like that. You know what I mean? And I just want to sit down again and be able to like breathe normally and stuff. And because you do, you feel, <coughs> you feel like you're just breathing like heavy all the time like this. Because I'm carrying <coughs> like two stone on me, what shouldn't be? Yeah. And it were, it's like fuck that. Like my brother, he's always on about getting bigger, you want to get bigger. And then I'm like, yeah, fuck this, man. I'm, I'm breathing every, everywhere. I feel unhealthy. This ain't good, this. I need to get some weight off me. Mm. You know what I mean? Because yeah. it's not good weight. But it's just a process, isn't it? I want to lose the weight first and then do the lean bulk. Mm. Rather than do a lean bulk now and then I have to cut what I lean bulked and what I've already got. That'll take yeah. ages. I need to probably lose more muscle doing that as well. Mm. Yeah. But wrong thing in it. Yeah. Like ice like not many Like not many people nowadays like they wanna look good but they wanna look good like appearance wise, you know, like clothing and whatnot. Like I don't know. Yeah. Like, there are people that go to the gym still. But there's not a lot. If you know what I mean? No. They have like 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 the dedication just to have that diet and then you know all that dross rather than just eating going to the gym and eating going to the gym. People have different goals though. Yeah yeah yeah. yeah. That's what I mean. Go wise. Like, uh uh-uh. People want to get ripped as fuck. People just want to be healthy. Mm. Want to be able to play with the kids. Or have a kick about with the mates. Mm. People want to lose weight. People want to gain weight. Mm. Yeah. You can be healthy and look, uh, you know, and look like me. You can be healthy and look like you. So it doesn't really matter, does it? No. Depends what you want. Mm-hmm. Like, um, so... Like, you were on about starting your own vlogging channel. <laughs> yeah. At like, some point. Would you, like, when? Uh, like, why be, as well? Why? Honest, probably... Probably end of March, April next year. Why not now? 
Because I can't edit my vlogs. Well, you just send them me and I'll edit yeah, them. Yeah, you will edit how I want to edit them. Well, you can come around and edit them, and I'll That's come around to you and edit them. Oh, I could do, I suppose. Fuck it, uh, yeah, come around to you. <laughs> yeah, go on then, I will do. It's <laughs> no effort for me. Because, like, if you start now, by the time you're in March, you'll have. Loads of content, won't yeah, you? Yeah, an established than, channel. Yeah, and in March, if you, it's like it's like you. It's like a lot of people say, oh, "I'll do it tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow." Yeah, I'll do it tomorrow. Like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll start it, tomorrow. I'll, it, I'll start tomorrow. And then, like, if you just start, mm. like if you watch a bit of Gary V, it, it, uh, Gary Vaynerchuk, it, it's just start. Just just do. Just start it because if you are saying you're gonna do it, you're not gonna do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like if you, it's easy, it's piss easy. It really is. Just what to do with the vlogging channel? Yeah, well, no, just easy to start. You yeah. think, oh, I need this. Like, like before I started. Well, I'd use my iPhone. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. Like I was, need, I was thinking, oh, I'll save up for my camera. Once I get my camera, I'll start vlogging on my camera. Mm. But I was like, oh, I've got my phone. I'll use that. It's yeah. Not the same, but it is. Yeah, similar. It's all, you're always it's always on you. Yeah. You can always just pop it out, and it's it don't matter. Like I sometimes it's two minutes, sometimes it's ten minutes. Do you know when you're going on a journey with your car and you speed it up on like your dashboard? Can you do you use your phone for that as yeah. well? Can you do your phone for that? No, it's time lapse. You got time lapse right on you on your phone. Yeah. So I, I use that. Yeah, you will do. Like um, but like I started thirty days ago. Yeah. Oh, I've, I've got time lapse. Anyway, go on. Like I started thirty days ago, and I've got thirty videos of like like what I've been doing sort of thing like if you think 30 days ago what were you doing you don't know yeah I don't know yeah, like, that's what I mean like if you just start tomorrow you don't even need like channel art you just need just upload yeah exactly like I spent pit. like I used to piss around oh I need to go channel art yeah we have to do my channel art for me yeah we'll do but like you've got to like I was focusing on I need the camera first I need this, I need this before I start if I don't have this, no one yeah. will think this. Yeah. Like, it's just... You yeah, a lot of people are bothered, they? they just watch, they watch it, they're not bothered what you got or what you use or what you're in. Yeah, I, I am, because well, I, I like cameras and everything, I'm always intrigued on what people use, but most yeah. people just watch it, oh, yeah, I'm not and bothered. it's just like that. Yeah. Yeah. I couldn't tell the difference in cameras, obviously I can if you use a DSLR, but for the most part, the audio and all that quality and all that stuff, you can't, people can't tell. No. People are bothered. No. People want to watch it because they want to watch what you're doing, who you are, what you know, what you're doing, what you're about, your yeah. content. They're not bothered how it comes across. Mm. Like um, another thing is like, like in high school, like you were bothered about people like knowing <laughs> you're doing YouTube like that. You've got to sort of get get to the point where you don't care if people know you. Yeah, doing like it. I, like I've got. Like, I used to care like a bit ago, like what people thought of me. Like once you get in in, in your head, oh, I don't care what people yeah, think that, of me. Like if you've got in your head, like why? Unless you're going out for a meal with someone, you know. But, like in day to day life, if so, like why would why should I care what this person thinks of me? I don't know them. They yeah. have no influence on my life. Like, mm. like if you get that, and you do YouTube. It's just all yeah, vlogging it's just, and chatting. Yeah, it's, it's a bit cringy sometimes, though, isn't it? If you're walking in the middle of town and, hey, look at me, I've been walking in pocket past everyone. It is a bit cringy. It can be, but it's... I mean, it's only cringy if you make it cringy, but I'd probably make it cringy for myself. <laughs> yeah. And you probably would as well, that minute. Yeah. It's... Just just do it. Just uh, Like I was saying, it's easy. You just... Like, with your phone, I don't know whether you can do it. Oh, you just you just swipe, don't you? Yeah. And then, and then you swipe up, and it's like, "Hey guys, welcome to another like good morning, welcome to another vlog today." Yeah. I've got this to eat. I'm doing this yeah, yeah. work. Like at work, you could go to your car. Or what do you eat in the office now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I always did. Look at that. At school, it used to be like, right, break time into my car. Yeah, that's a that's a, that old job, man. That they were. Yeah. Yeah. It, it was just different click at that one. Yeah. But it's that easy. You just yeah. swipe, swipe, click. Mm. And you just vlog about what you do. Yeah. Nah, I might. Because it, it gave me something to do. Yeah, that's the it whole point I started as well. I had nothing. I was just... 
and then it'd be nice to look back on it as well yeah. and it's like if you get you know what I mean and you see like the process of like the quality like you start off with just like clips you know like boring yeah. clips and then you get better yeah. and better and better, and better yeah it's easy to do you should it, like it's just doing it yeah that's the hard part well it's not hard but it is for some well, for most people yeah I need a laptop or an iMac, MacBook. Yeah. I've been wanting one of them anyway, but one of them would be ideal to edit and stuff on it. Oh, yeah, they're good. They're better than computers. Yeah. In my opinion, for what I do, for what it's just. Yeah. I just, it's easy because you can like in your house. What do you use to edit your videos? Adobe Premiere. It's easy. Yeah, you know, son of Vegas. No, you can't get it on Mac. Like I, I, I did before. Like, I got Windows on Mac. Yeah, yeah. But it was horrible, like, every yeah, performance and that. Yeah, it's, like, Adobe Premiere is really... Is it easy to use? Like, you'll get used to it. Yeah. You learn, You have to learn it first, but it is easy. Buy it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's easier. I think it's way better than Adobe. Do you still use Photoshop? Yeah, yeah, I use Photoshop and Lightroom. I use Lightroom. Well, Photoshop's out now. I used last Photoshop I used was CS5. Yeah, Photos CS7. There's a lot of sound. Yeah. Um, but don't worry about like thumbnails and that. Just worry no, about no, recording. I probably won't even put thumbnails on my videos. To be fair. Mm. What I do is like in, in Adobe Premiere. There's this like like a a snapshot like button, and you just click it, and it takes that image and puts it on your on desktop, the and you edit it, time, and then you put yeah. it up. Yeah. Yeah. So you just edit that image. Yeah. Yeah. But just do it. Like, it, like, it's easy to say I'll do it tomorrow. Mm. But once you get into the habit of doing it, it's easy. Yeah. Yeah. And, like, if you save up for a camera as well, do it on that, wouldn't you? Mm. And it, you, it's got... You can achieve something from it. Are you going to vlog the spin? Mm. Yeah. Well... Like you can achieve stuff from it now. Like even small channels, you can get like um, you know deals with companies. You do yeah. this. I literally I want the most. To be fair, now the most interesting YouTube channels I think are the ones where guys sit in the basement or whatever and they vlog their life and it's the the it's raw footage. And people are sat in the rooms in the middle of New York talking about the days and shit like that. I find that more interesting than people who make effort into making a video and make it into like a production. Mm. I don't find that shit interesting. You know what I mean? I find it, you know, I, I watched this guy. He's called like David Borowski and he was doing the, the, what were you doing now? He was doing Sanitar. And he was doing, I watched him and he used to vlog about it and he just put the, vi- the like a camcorder in his yeah. garage. And he did like 37 minutes every video, that's how long it took him. And he non stop, no editing or anything. And he, and then he'd vlog about like his life and stuff in his car and stuff as well. Greg Valentino, like his videos, because it's just him in front of a camera, I'm in his car. Yeah. Uh, they're the best ones, I think, now. They're, I've, they're more entertaining to me than than bloody someone who's, I'm not saying making an effort, because people who do normal stuff make an effort, but to like get it out there and make it into a production and all that. Mm. Other than Rich Pianas, what we're going to put, obviously, you don't, yeah. you've gone in and out, so yeah. everyone else now is pretty much, I don't watch anyone. Mm. They do what you It's interesting, do, man, like, I watched a video of the other few months back of a guy, He ju- apparently he'd just become homeless, and he was living in his car, and he was documenting living in his car with his phone. Yeah. I watch them all day long, me. I find them interesting. They yeah. are interesting, rather than... I don't know, some sports panel or some some other stuff like that. You, what, what do you mean by, like, production sort of thing? Like, vlog, are you talking about vlogging or, like... Uh, yes, yeah, so even, like, the, all these professional vloggers and that. Yeah. Like, these massive ones where, you know, the lives seem so fucking great all the time and the perfect lighting everywhere they go and they've... You know what I mean? They're going to all these events and shit and look at me. You know what I mean? I'd rather watch someone... Talk about how depressed they are living in his car for the next three weeks, and how he's going to get out of that situation. Yeah. That's more entertaining to me. Like real life that situations shit. that you yeah. can relate to, sort of thing. Yeah. 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 See what you mean? Yeah. 
They are way better. Yeah. Especially if you laid in bed at night, man, and you, you're going through, you got, you're going to the depths of YouTube, and you watch one video into another, don't you? Yeah. And you end up coming across that cycle of stuff like that. I watch it for bloody hell. You just don't, you get up to watching all sorts. You know what I mean? Mm. That's what that's what I'm into at the minute. But so like you reckon you'll start tomorrow? Straight don't face. Don't know. Don't know. It's easy. Just do it. Yeah, but I need someone to edit my stuff. You got your computer. It works, doesn't it? It works, but I've no internet connection. You've got Sony Vegas on it, haven't you? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think I have, yeah. I have no internet connection, though. You just transfer it to your phone and then upload it via your phone, wouldn't you? Yeah, I could do, I suppose. I don't know how you do that. I have to Google it. Hmm. But, um... Yeah, so I need a laptop or something because it'd be so easier. No, use cotton No, it's just yeah, easier yeah. to not use it rather than argue about using it. <laughs> what sis? What you been saying around me? Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, like, like in twenty eighteen, what are your goals? <sighs> Get. Fit. Start vlogging my life, as interesting as that'll be, and then just save up some money, man, for a down payment. I think. Yeah. Yeah, but it's. Here's one thing. It's right? gonna be. A, it's gonna be. Twenty eighteen is gonna be. A transit, a big year for transitioning in my life. Yeah. For a few things. For lots of things. Like the like, like, yeah. Like um if it's all do that's why I wanna document it because it'll Well yeah, I just wanna document it. Like my sort of like view, like you know like you want a house, down payment on a house. Would you well, I ju well it's not ultimately yeah, but I want ten, fifteen grand sat in the bank. Whether that's for a down payment or whether that's just I've got 10, 15 grand sat in my bank. Mm. I want a big lump of money in my bank back end of next year. No matter what that's for. Probably it's for a house, but and it's no like matter that. what it's for, it's a safety blanket. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like if I had 10 grand sat in my bank right now, I'd, you know what I mean? I sleep easy now, but I'd sleep even easier if I had 10 grand sat in my bank. Because you never know mm. what's around that corner, do you? No. You know what I mean? Like, you, you know my old job? Two lads have just resigned there yesterday. Old? Oh, two, no, my age. Oh, right. They both resigned yesterday on the same day. Why? Because it, it was shit. Oh, right. It was shit, I'll tell you about it, but it was shit. So they've now lost five people in under 12 months. That's massive stuff turnover for the size of that company. Yeah. They said there were only about 15 people in the company and five of them have gone within like eight, ten months. That's not good, that. No. Uh -huh. But exactly, you know what I mean? What if I lost my job? If I have no money saved up, I'm fucked at the minute. Do you know what I mean? Which is why I want some money saved up yeah. for a rainy day. Mm. And I want to go. Tra I want to travel a lot next year as well. We say it all the time, man. We say it every year. But, you know what I mean? It's going mean, to be a start of it because, uh, you know what I mean? Before, before last year, I have been anywhere. And now I've gone to Belgium and now I'm going to Spain. You know what I mean? That's two places within twelve months, so I'm gonna I wanna travel man. Yeah. Yeah. Like um, What about you? Like goals. Yeah. Um, 18. Bulk up. This is like like minimum priority sort of thing. Yeah. I'm not too bothered if it happens or not. Um, bulk up, and then I just want to sort of like like branch out on like my YouTube channel, like just do 
like travel England, like you know, like Will Sanders and yeah. Cowboy, Urban Cowboy. So I want I want to like travel and explore like abandoned buildings. I want to mm. go rooftop in. I want to yeah. just do more. Like, yeah. um, like when it becomes summer or light again earlier. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like um, I want to get into photography again. Like I want to yeah. try like offer out free like portraits you know what I mean like take the photos yeah. families or whatever do it to some of my my family myself and then offer out free like testers and if they like it they pay for it or whatever you know yeah. what I mean yeah um, and like sort of just start like trying to work for myself sort of thing mm. and just doing photography whether it be like, even like for a brand you know like car dealerships like mm. doing like a video for them or yeah photography for the for them just trying to like get out there in like the film photography mm. sort of business but um and then i just want to sort of grow my youtube like and collaborate with other people that do it yeah and just meet new people really mm. sort of like the only person i speak to at the moment is you mm. so if i've got like other people that uh that no, like, know what I'm doing and sort of, oh, yeah. do you fancy filming a video? Like, blah, blah, blah. I want to get more people I know. Like, I want to get more friends. That sounds sad, but you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I only like, speak I want... to you, Sam, Andy and Michael, mm. um, and like, a couple of my brother's friends, but I don't, I don't see any of my brother's friends, really. Mm. Fucking hell, I only see you and Sam, really. Yeah. That's it. Like, like, I it's want... not wrong with that, but obviously, it'd be, you know, you know if, if, you, if there were more people to do stuff with yeah. in certain hobbies if you knew people what like going out adventuring if you knew people what like going out um, photography and if you knew people want to go out bowling with you you know what I mean just you, people that like doing stuff you do the people that have the, like, the same yeah. mind as you so mindset yeah like say if I met someone that wanted to be like a, like it was a vlogger mm. and then you club and stuff yeah just made videos yeah. with other people you know <laughs> Mm. all that um, like yeah. I like helping I like helping people out I mean but that's like further yeah. on I guess do you want to buy me an iMac <laughs> what if I, I was rich if I was, if I was rich but yeah. like um, I just want to grow in 2018 really mm. sort of put in the work to like on like social media mm. or like get the videos out start making like like one way of getting big on YouTube did you see that video at Nightscape that got on top of the Etihad Stadium no they did a video of them getting on the stadium I don't know if it was Etihad well it was a live game no no it? it was dead All right, at yeah. night and they got like they got listed on Unilad and mm. they got like 5 million views and then ever since that video he's like I think he's on like 1.5 or something now wow and that was a year ago like one like if you do like a stupid crazy video on something yeah and you even if you get like a fraction of that you know mm. people are going to discover you you're going to get more yeah traction. attention and that, yeah. yeah but um yeah, man. We'll just have to do it. We'll have to knuckle down, do the things that That's... we say we're gonna do. Mm. Because how fast has this year gone? It's real quick. And every year gets faster, doesn't it? Yeah. That's like, that's they one go thing. Go fast, man. That's why we can't sit around and me a bit more than anyone. Because it just leaves. Like I was in the fish and chip shop tonight. Yeah. Mm. Like, I was stood there, and I was sort of the guy behind. Like, I I remember like ages ago when I was younger. Like the guy behind cooking all the stuff. He's been there for fucking ages. Yeah. And I sort of, like, I uh, do you ever, like, see things and you can just put something there? Like, vision. Yeah. You see, like, like, I was just stood there leaning, looking at him, and just sort of, like, sort of, like, popping my head on, like, his yeah. head. And just sort of, you okay, know. Okay, yeah, if I carry on, I'm, this is where I'm going to yeah, be. Yeah, yeah. And life's just going to pass me by. I'm going to be like everyone else, yeah. Yeah. Like, just... It's not what we want. No. Yeah, like, I wish everyone was like that, but not everyone's like that. Everyone no. can be cushy. Yeah, I'm cushy. Like, mm. uh, I just want to live a normal life, but if. Yeah. Don't really. Don't appeal. No. No, it don't appeal to me either. Like, um, 
the one thing you've got to sort of, like I said to you, you've got to sort of like sacrifice time now. Mm. Like, some things I'm like that. Some things I am like a normal person because you know I'll, I will I've I'll, I've sort of accepted things in life. That and that's you where might that's have. yeah, that's what I mean. Like if you get to that point, you sort of like yeah. Oh, but if I do this, it's oh I might lose this, you know. If, like it's yeah, it, you like it's like fear, like you're mm. sort of fearing what could happen. Like if you had fifteen grand in the bank, yeah, mm. and you just said fuck it, I'm leaving the company, I'm leaving Courtney, yeah, I'm just fucking off somewhere for a year and s- just see what happens. Yeah. And then when you come back, if nothing happened, you could find another job, yeah, and just do yeah, that. we'll do it like get it booked in. Yeah, I wish I could. Ah, uh, we will, man. I wanna, I wanna. Travel, and it's like that thing with. It's like. 21, 22, 23, 24. Well, we're young, you know what I mean? Mm. It's like that thing. Like, I haven't got a girlfriend because if I had a girlfriend. Like, you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you had a girlfriend, you've got you to spend time with them and uh, it's. it's well, I'd yeah. rather. You don't like, have to, but you'll end up arguing every night you'll tell me about a girlfriend. <laughs> Uh, it's um yeah yeah it's you just yeah like at the moment I don't see the point in it like no I'm not bothered like you and Sam go on about like sex is this almighty yeah, yeah. thing no right? we go on about it's not that's the point it's not you're making it I like, don't make it like that I don't, we, I'm not bothered you, it's really it's not I couldn't give a fuck I'm after the first time I did the first time after I went like, fucking hell I've waited 18 years for that and I put it on a big thing and I've done it as well is that it Mm. that's what I felt like and now it's like it's not nobody's fucking bothered man yeah really yeah. Like, we'll take the piss <laughs> when we're in front of you we'll be over there because it is, it is funny sometimes yeah and it is a bit of a tease but fucking hell you'd, you know what I mean I'd expect to be teased as well if I were like that but it's not at the end of the day man nobody's fucking bothered man, when it comes yeah. down to it you know what I mean and no it's not we all know you know what I mean it's going to happen Eventually. You'll get there and then, it, and then it, yeah, but then you'll be like after you'll be like fucking hell, yeah, you know it's not that big of a deal. I've done it. I'm nervous, bothered. I'm fucking move on to the next one. You know what I mean? Like, it is that thing. Yeah. Mm. You know what I mean? I'm not fucking. It's like, know. like, like it's time wise as well. Like if it I is, s- of, it is time consuming, and you know what I mean. If it's like you said, like it's like you. Uh, <laughs> It's 100%. like a, it's like you said the other the other week about Sam, like you know he's got now he's got the kid. Yeah. He's sort of more oriented about being around the kid and mm. whatnot and being with. It's responsibilities, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I mean. Like if it's you have no responsibilities, you can just be yourself. But if you've got yeah, like you've if you want to keep your girlfriend, you've got to keep Put time her entertained. And, 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 yeah, you, know, you want to you've got to want to keep her. And it's where, like, if I said to you, like, one, one, one week, I was like, oh, I mean, like, I'm gonna be doing some stuff with Ed, in next year. But um, uh, like, if I said to you, oh, we're going down to Edinburgh or, or yeah, up London, to Edinburgh. or up to, down to London yeah. to explore this place on a weekend, yeah, and like. I said to you, and you were like, oh, mm-hmm. you know, yeah. oh, Courtney, let me just Courtney, Courtney, can I go down to London for a weekend? <laughs> yeah. yeah nah. Nah, it's, like, it's like that, that's the yeah, thing. I know I, it is. And that's what... Yeah, but I know it's like that at the minute, but it annoys you when it's like that, but it annoys me that you can't see that it is, you know it's like that for me, so don't yeah. get annoyed at me, yeah, yeah, yeah. because it annoys me when you get annoyed at me, because you know it's like that. <laughs> but it's like... like I can I, I know never... it's I know it's not ideal, but th- that's how it's for me at the minute. Do you reckon if you left Courtney, you'd find another girlfriend if you wanted? <sighs> Fucking hell! Not that's the same. A though, would it? question, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Like Courtney told me when we went to what's it? Your are they cousins? Pub. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Um, like if if you and Courtney split up, mm. she would find it hard to go out and date other people. Yeah, I would immediately after. Yeah. I if if it happened, that I'd fucking hard, I'd, I'd want to stay single for a while, man. Do you know what I mean? Because mm. so it's a big commitment, man. Especially at our age. 
you know what I mean? It's more, you know, it's more... Especially moving in. Exactly, yeah. And then we're both stressed out all the time because we've no money. And then, you know what I mean, it's we're around each other all the time. We're, we're getting sick of each other because we're around each other all the time. And then, you know what I mean, she gets bad migraines and stuff. And, you know, it's she try, it takes an hour for her to get home f- to back to flat at a minute. And it's not ideal. And it's just shit like that what builds up. And then you've got your mates asking you, are you coming on? You know, you're coming out or you're coming on PS4 or whatever, and it's, you know what I mean? That's what I was saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you got to juggle all that. But it has its plus signs as well, it's not all bad, fucking hell. I'm not an advocate for f- fucking it off, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. But that's just how it is. It's, um. It, mm. It's like that thing. Like, it's hard to put it across. Um, like, like I said like, to you, I know you wouldn't do it, but like, if you and Courtney like mm. had a break mm. for like two years, mm. big long break that, yeah. and then you go back together, mm. it'd be you'd be like, you'd have more time. Like I'm trying to think, like if you were able to if you got rid of all everything else in your life that's a, a distraction or whatever and you just devote two three years to something mm. uh, like you could like at the moment you've got loads of well you've got distractions anyway yeah. would you say yeah. yeah like work and whatnot but if you, like you won't have to get rid of work just like if yeah well the big one's gonna when i move back in with my dad i'm gonna have no flat distractions yeah i'm gonna be able to save 600 pound a month you know what I mean? Mm. Without any distractions. Yeah, it's it's. And then I literally all I'll have then is just my job, and then I'll see Courtney whenever I see her on a weekend or whatever, or for a week. Yeah. And that'll be it. It just it's just being able to sort of hustle down and just work on one thing mm. rather than. Like I reckon if if like if we both did vlogging, mm. like proper vlogging. Yeah. And are you just stuck at it? Like, one. Oh, fuck, what was the quote? I can't remember it, but one, like, you're, you're solid on your own. Mm. But, like, with numbers, you sort of. You work. Yeah. You c- the workload sort of. Comes easier. Yeah. Mm. Like, if we both did it, we could sort of. Contact people, you know, do other videos mm. with other people rather yeah. than on your own. And it'd be easy just travelling as well, rather mm. than just on your own. Yeah. But it's, oh, it's that it, thing of having the... the. the eight, 2018 is going to be a big year. Dedication. That's what I'm going to say. Yeah. We'll, but we'll get there, man. Yeah. I'm going to have more free time in 2018. And when do you leave your flat? End of February. Oh, right. I thought it was March, September, March. No, end of February. Pay my last month's rent for February. On my dad's birthday, so and that's it. Three week after that, I'm moving out. I'll get my stuff. I'll move my stuff back to my dad's, and then that'll be it, man. I ain't got that much to move over, and I can start saving then. So from March, just paycheck going forward. Mm. Shit, yeah. I'll be all right. Yeah. Just. It's hard to get across that, like uh, if you just work mm. at one thing, yeah. rather than trying to work at several little, little things, yeah. you'll be a lot better. And you'll, like, I sort of want the best for everyone. Yeah. And like, my mindset is like, if you work now, mm. ten ten years of just pure putting in effort, content, all that. You'll either at the end of it, you'll be fuck all, nothing's <laughs> happened. You've gained, you've got a lot of content, you've got that, yeah, you've got that to look back on. Like, even if you like, I didn't like cameras until I sort of like started watching you know, like ski jumpers, yeah, like taking pictures. That's the only reason why I got into mm. I was on holiday and I ordered one on holiday. Like, if you got into cameras and you started really liking it, yeah, like you could start doing your own stuff, like, like I said. 
what mm. I want to do in 2018. Yeah. But um, it's a hobby as well. Mm. Isn't it? It's something to do. It's something for me to do, especially when I'm back in with my dad. Mm. And if I'll be bored every night again at home. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it's you like if you want to. If you've got a camera and you can go out and do something, you yeah. can vlog it and it makes you want to go out. Like at the moment when it's like this, shit weather, mm. I don't really want to go out. And the fact that it's my phone as well mm. doesn't help. It's just my phone. That's mm. it. Um, but yeah. yeah, if you just hustle down and for 10 years, nothing. if something comes up in those 10 mm. years, wicked, yeah. but you, you'll never know unless you start. If you don't do it, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah um, man. I think we'll end it on that, yeah. Till next not week. Gonna be happy. Till next week. Yeah. So uh, we'll thanks find for out what watching. happened tonight. Next week. Yeah. Yeah. So um, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you did enjoy. So, nice man. one, guys. Yeah. Till next um, week. If Alex starts vlogging tomorrow and his channel's up, I'll put the link in the description. But other than that, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Peace out.